Sorry guys, Coach Owen Roddy here, back with another Coach Roddy Breakdown. Um, so this weekend guys, we have a very exciting fight, uh, UFC Fight Nights, Cerrone versus Gaethje. Uh, two stand-up fighters, although Gaethje is, you know, is regarded as a, a, a very, very high, high level wrestler. He is a very, very high level wrestler, very accomplished, but he likes to get in and just have a knock, which is, which is exciting, which the fans obviously like as well. Cerrone, everybody knows what Cerrone likes to do. He does the same. Straight in there, stand toe to toe, uh, and bang. So um, this is a this is a, a fight for the fans. It's going to be an exciting fight, and uh, I'm looking forward to myself. So things that um, things to watch out for. Starting off with Cerrone. Um, Cerrone comes in. He's, he's, he starts well. He, he puts the pressure on people. Keeps it long and rangy. He's got long, good long straight shots. Um, good leg kicks. And, and that nice step head kick and step kick to the body. Um, I think if you can get off early and and, and um, maintain the range, pop those shots, he, he can have some success with uh, with, with, with that style. Um, good at walking those kicks to the body as well, gauge you with those hands high and everything. There might be an opportunity for him to land that, land that liver kick that he's landed uh, so many times in previous fights. Um, also, you're fighting with Gaethje, Gaethje's a pressure fighter, so Cerrone's probably going to have to pop shots and, and be on his bike and hope that Gaethje will walk onto something. Um, Gaethje on the other hand, Gaethje's going to come forward, hands high, right, elbows in, chin down, pop those shots, keep the pressure on. Um, if you remember Cerrone and Ferguson, Cerrone started well, he was landing shots, he was, he was landing those clean straight shots on Ferguson, but Ferguson just kept that pressure on, kept walking him down, and in the second and third round, um, you, you started to see um, Cerrone fade, and, and uh, Ferguson really started to take control. Um, if Gaethje can Im implement the same game plan, I, I see it going Gaethje's way. Um, moving forward, putting that pressure on, catching the shots, getting, getting, um, uh, Cerrone to try and exit and then throw those wide hooks in the the big big left hook. It was a left hook, I think. It was a left hook that he landed on Barbosa, and I think it was the same left hook that he landed on the fight previous to that. Um, I forget the guy's name, but it doesn't it doesn't come to me at the moment. But watch his last two fights. It was that that exit. The guys were exiting. He was fighting that big hook over the top. Um, I, I honestly don't see it going to the ground. You know. And it's it's a toss up. You've got the the really high level wrestler, um, pressure fighter and Gaethje, and you have um, Cerrone who's who's slick off his back, the triangles and stuff. Spent spent a good few years landing landing uh, submissions earlier on in his career. So an exciting fight. The big thing is it's it's one for the fans. Um, which way do I see it going? I I, I would tend to favour Gaethje in this one. Just looking back on, on the, the Ferguson and Cerrone fight, um, I see Gaethje coming in with the same game plan. Walking them down, covering up, catch, catching the shots on the arms and then and then firing his hands. Also Gaethje's got that good good leg kick. If he gets that off early and starts to slow um, Cerrone down, it, it, could be, um, it could be a tough night for Cerrone. Um, but Cerrone's in there, nothing to lose. Uh, he's fighting with no pressure. He, that's the way Cerrone fights. Okay, and that's that's a good thing to have. Um, going in there, no pressure. Just going in there, having fun and um, putting the pressure on. And you know, if Gaethje's a bit lazy, you might see that, that that right hand, right head kick, or that jab, kick to the liver. But for me, I I would um, I would uh, be I would be tipping Gaethje for this one. But uh, it's going to be an exciting fight for you guys. I'm loving all the comments. So. Uh, Stick your predictions below. We'll announce the winner. Um, all your comments, what what you what what you think I haven't talked about, could be a, that could be a factor in the in the fights. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Hit the not uh, the notifications, and we will catch you on uh, on the next one. We'll do the the review on Monday or Tuesday. Talk to you in a bit, guys. Cheers.